Let's have a little look at Keir trying to rustle up a personality. <laughs> These aren't the droids you're looking for. No rules were broken. The economy is booming. The problem is, the force just isn't with him anymore. He, th he thinks he's Obi-Wan Kenobi. The truth is, he's Jabba the Hutt. He, he, he thinks he's on Love Island. The trouble is, Prime Minister, I'm reliably informed that contestants that give the public the ick get booted out. Yeah. Off you go, Diane and Josh. When did we stop wanting boring? When did we want our politicians to take us on this horrendous roller coaster that we seem to be on with Boris Johnson and his harem of battered eunuchs? You have Angela Rayner criticise Keir for what he's wearing. Excuse me, Ms Growler? 2022, the only MP who willingly upskirts herself <laughs> is criticizing what this guy's wearing. OK, so he wears the same navy blue jacket, white shirt and plum tie every single week. He's like a cartoon character, <laughs> but he's predictable. Isn't that nice? Wouldn't it be nice if during this time when Russia has invaded Ukraine, something we never thought would happen, cost of living crisis, never thought would happen, coronavirus pandemic, never thought would happen. Wouldn't it be amazing if we had just one boring, stable, solid, beige guy just trying to get us through it all? I don't know when, as a nation, we became so used to abuse, we became so used to lies, we became so used to going, what have they done now? Really? Oh, my God. Like, why have we got used to this? And why do we accept that that's OK? Because we're addicted to drama. Well, I say, don't be addicted to drama anymore. Be addicted to boring. Sir Keir, boring. <laughs> Anything to add, Josh? He's been provoked into trying to seem interesting, which he's not. The tabloids want him to sort of mess up. Otherwise, they got nothing. What are they going to publish? Oh, Keir Starmer had sex with his wife. Missionary <laughs> position. Uh, Keir Starmer has a normal amount of children. Uh, <laughs> Keir Starmer knows the names of his kids. Uh, <laughs> It's not going to work. We don't want anybody interesting. Um, any questions to throw at the spin doctors? There's a danger that Keir is trying to make himself more interesting with his, with his snappy pop culture references that are 43 years old. <laughs> <laughs> I like that reference. I thought he was coming in, he was throwing a little bit of, you know, it was like, it was good. I, I mean, I think what franchise, if he starts doing like Fast and the Furious or something, <laughs> I would, uh, that would be like, hey, we're all family here in the Labour Party. <laughs> <laughs> Don't think that would work. But I like the Star Wars stuff. But yeah, it's just like, mate, you know, you know that he thought the prequels were okay. Ooh. Yeah, no, that's a big <laughs> insult. Yeah, he should have he <laughs> used those instead, being like Boris Johnson's so posh. He's like, uh, he's like rah rah binks. <laughs> well, both well spun, but ultimately it's up to me to decide who has the best spin, and I think the most compelling defence came from the red team. Yeah!